Welcome to the National Weather Service Des Moines Hazardous Weather Briefing, updated at 1 p.m. on Wednesday, March 19th. We are looking at the threat for severe weather across much of the state later today, primarily during the late afternoon and evening hours, with the potential for all modes of severe weather possible, including damaging winds, large hail, and even a few tornadoes. Latest outlook from the Storm Prediction Center has much of the state in at least a slight risk for severe storms later today, including an enhanced risk, which stretches from about the Omaha metro area and areas north and eastward into western and central Iowa. The greatest threat to see a tornado later today would be highlighted from, again, about the Omaha metro area to points just to the north and east, primarily covering southwest and west central Iowa. This would be primarily during the late afternoon and early evening hours, although we can't rule out the potential for a tornado as the storms push off further east. The threat for hail also covers about the same area where you would see that enhanced risk that we just showed. This would stretch from, again, southwest, west central Iowa, and points of central Iowa, including the Des Moines metro and the Waterloo area. This is where we would be at risk of seeing hail to the size of golf balls or potentially larger with any thunderstorm activity. The threat for damaging winds also encompasses most of the state, although not as high as a probability of hail. This would stretch past the Des Moines metro area into eastern Iowa as we go into the overnight hours. Now we're going to take a look at potential thunderstorm timing. Keep in mind this is just model simulated radar imagery and not an official forecast. We are expecting storms to develop in the vicinity of a cold front in eastern Nebraska and western Iowa late this afternoon. As you can see by 7 o'clock these storms will be pushing in through the western part of the state. As we go toward 10 o'clock much of these storms have now pushed into central Iowa and by 1 o'clock they have now pushed off into the eastern part of the state. If you have noticed in this radar imagery that the thunderstorms become much more scattered as they get into central and eastern Iowa, and this would reflect the lower thunderstorm probabilities in these areas. So again, recapping, we do have a threat for severe weather across much of the state of Iowa later today, primarily late afternoon and evening, with the threat for damaging winds, large hail, and possibly a few tornadoes. Keep in mind you can always find our fork latest forecast online at weather.gov Des Moines and just type in your city, state, or zip code. We also have additional information available through the Storm Prediction Center. You can also get more local information on our webpage at weather.gov slash DMS slash DSS Severe. We also disseminate plenty of information through our social media outlets, so check us out on Facebook and Twitter for more information. This concludes the National Weather Service Des Moines Hazardous Weather Briefing.